Your sequence of logical actions didn't achieve their desired results. You're not doing the mimic thing. We always do the mimic thing. What's the point? Oh, wow. Sienna dumped you, huh? Worse. She bought me a car. And that's a problem? How hard did that kangaroo hit you? Look, you don't get it. My girlfriend has a career, and the only jobs I can get are either working for Rico or letting exotic animals beat and squeeze the snot and other liquids out of me. I'm gonna pretend you're talking about a water bottle in your pocket and move on. If only. Well, at least your job doesn't make you choose between the opportunity of a lifetime and your best friend. Hey, that's the price you pay for being so ridiculously talented. Okay, first no mimic thing and now a compliment? Seriously, Jackson, how hard did that kangaroo hit you? Look, I know that things are bad right now with Lily, but trust me, the way my life is going, I, I would so rather be you than me. Oh, don't worry, Jackson, you'll get a real job. Someday. You've got a lot to offer. Like what? I don't know, but whatever it is, you definitely got a boatload of it. And one day, someone's going to give you a job that is worthy of your as-yet undiscovered talents. As-yet undiscovered talents. As-yet undiscovered talents. Seriously, now? Sorry, I was just starting to feel close to you, and it was creeping me out. But thanks. And don't worry. I'm sure you and Lily are going to figure this out. I, mean, I can't imagine you guys not being best friends. I don't know, Jackson. I mean, I really messed up. I've never seen her so mad. And it didn't help at all when you asked her to go to Paris with you? I didn't ask her. <laughs> you ask her to go everywhere. Tours, concerts. I mean, you didn't even go to the bathroom without asking her if she wants to come along. Hey, all girls do that. You never know when you need to borrow a lipstick or toilet paper. And Lily carries three-ply with aloe. I'm gonna miss that. Seriously, men and women, same species, worlds apart. Jackson, look, Lily does not want to go to Paris. I mean, she really wants to go to college. She wanted to go to Paris, she would have started dropping hints the minute I told her about it. Oh no. What? She started dropping hints the minute I told her about it. You're the last person I would want to go to college with. No, you're the last person that I would want to go anywhere with. That was a hint? Yeah. She said go anywhere with. She could have stopped at college, but no. She said anywhere. Which means Paris, the place I didn't ask her to go. And why would she hint at Paris if she didn't want to go? All right, let me try to think like a girl. <laughs> no, still don't get it. You know, maybe you're right. When Lily's really fishing for something, she always has a pfft at the end. Oh, no. You go away to Paris to do a stupid movie and you can't even speak French? See? She did a pfft. But it was delayed. It was a delayed pfft. A delayed pfft? Yes, a delayed pfft. Which is why I didn't see it. Jackson, you're right. I have to go talk to her. Thank you. You're a genius. You're welcome. I don't know what I did, but you're welcome. I don't want to know why. I don't want to know how. I just want to enjoy this moment for as long as it lasts. I know the real reason you're mad at me. Oh, really? What was your first clue when I told you? No. I said the real reason, little miss Pfft. What? I may have given you the pat, but you gave me the Pfft. And I know why. It's because I didn't ask you to go to Paris with me. Well, it sure took you long enough. Hey, it was a delay Pfft. I had a delayed reaction. You're being a little unfair. I'm being unfair? First you lied to me about the movie, and then you don't even want me to come with you? Look, Lily, of course I wanted you to go with me. It's just, I didn't ask because I knew how much college means to you. Really? Yeah. Well, you could have at least asked. Is it too late? Try me. Lily, do you want to go to Paris with me? No. No? Why'd you make me ask you? Because I needed to hear it. I 
I need to know that this friendship means as much to you as it does to me. And I can't put off college. Why not, Lily? Come on, picture it. Think about it. We're in Europe. All the culture and the history and the language. It'll be an educational experience that is fantastique. <laughs> That's fantastic in French. <laughs> Riley, come on. No, I'm serious. Think about it. Next year in class when they're talking about the golden arches of triumph, we'll have actually been there. It's, uh, it's the Arc de Triomphe. It's not some place you drive through to get fries. French fries? Hey. <laughs> Come on, Lily. Not only will it be an amazing learning experience, but you'll be around Tom Cruise and Steven Spielberg. Yo, Tommy, Stevie, can't I lecture you today, but try me tomorrow. Huh? That will be you. Well... Come on, your folks will be cool with it. I don't know. I mean, I always saw, you know, you go to high school and then you go to college, but... I guess people do take time off, and an opportunity like this, I mean, it is kind of fantastic. <laughs> do you really want me to go with you? More than anything. Well, then, how can I say no? We're going to Paris! Yay! <laughs> I can't wait to go see the awful tower. Kidding! <laughs>